When somebody tells you you have cancer, your life is totally changed. I was scared. Oh my God, I'm not gonna see my grandbabies grow up, you know. How much time do I have left? After chemo, I was kind of in the bed all the time because I was just worn out. It was really harsh for me. Cancer is an extremely difficult problem. Cancer patients often say the treatment is worse than the disease. So our thinking has gone from an absolute cure, which remains our goal, to actually developing a therapy that will help people live better. If we can reduce the amount of suffering that goes on, that would in fact be a great victory for us. Our work centers on how genetic engineering tools can be used to help cancer patients. A new tool has come online, and that's known as CRISPR. This technology is a true game changer in the field of biomedical research. That's great. We've been able to utilize it to help patients who are receiving chemotherapy, radiation therapy. These people need help now. The process, it's really hard. So I would like to see the research be able to allow people to function. Not only do we want to make new discoveries, we want to take it to help patients. We are the only gene editing institute embedded in a community cancer center in the world. So the lung cancer cells basically. That allows us to interact with oncologists, physicians, patient advocates, and of course patients I'll take a listen. And allows us to tailor our treatments. Your goal is to alleviate their pain. You know, you need to have that support. You need to know that people care for you. I think it makes that process a little bit easier. They really make you feel like a person. That's your spine, yeah. I hope that patients after me, that they don't go through what I went through. I feel like I'm getting back to my normal life. My whole perspective on life is different. Like, I live every day like it's my last. There are new discoveries being made in this lab every day. And our goal is to develop a technology that can reach patients soon. And it's happening today.